So welcome to my second video in the series of videos where I will be like reorganizing my K-pop photo card collection and it's really just like the binder um, setups. It's mostly because I wanted to free up a bit of space in the binders that I have because when I did my tour that's really when I saw that they were so full and you know I didn't want to compromise the protection of the photo cards you know that's the whole point of collecting so yeah this is the second video because the first one is actually a gin binder setup that i did so i will link that somewhere <laughs> if you want to check that out but now we're going to be focusing on like the bts binders um where i do have quite a fair bit of ot7 sets especially for the albums the korean albums and you know a bunch of like other stuff because you know BTS is like the first K-pop group that started it all for me and yeah I love them a lot and I have quite a few binders for them. Um, I'll be showing you the spine of this current binder that we're looking at just because I want you to see like the little spine design that I have. It's super simple. It's just a hollow sticker that I printed the BTS logo on. Can you even see it? And um, I just have a little description of like what's in the binder right there that's also printed on a hollow sticker. I do put a bit of design on the spine because I do store my binders like vertically so that's what I see on the shelf and I do use like different types of binders, different colors of binders and it's just you know the uniformity like that just makes it nice and cohesive even if there's still variety. So the cover for this is actually the the icon poster, like the really huge poster of OT7, and I cut it up um, because I don't see it. It's just rolled up in that little canister that it came in, so it's a sh it's a shame because this is like clearly a gorgeous photo. So I just cut it up into to two. I actually had to like bring these closer together because Shugo was like super far away from the rest of the group, so I just had to cut that up and like bring him closer in so that's how you can see the four of them the other half is in the next binder that we'll cover so for the first one which is a biggie she actually houses quite a lot of things and there are all of these post-its here because i had to pre-plan this video because i think if i didn't this video would be like 24 hours long yeah <laughs> all right so we'll start by actually removing this because these are paper so clearly they're like damaged and i will be replacing it with these like plastic um binder tabs with just a super simple label right there as you can see this will be mustard so this will change um well not this page because i actually put this here um i kept this here because this this really was the second page i think of the miscellaneous section the first page is now in my gin binder and this is from the fifth muster now this i do want to move to my tools binder which will come up later what we'll just do is just get actually my muster section Yes, I do just want to move these all to the front. Surprise, it happened. Except for these, just because there is an Ultra Pro page right there. Nice. Okay, so let's just flip through. Ah. Okay, now this will now be the miscellaneous section 
Um, we have the army bomb. Ooh, put these. We'll set aside. I guess we'll put that somewhere else a little bit later. Um, yes. Exhibition bits. The icon, which I actually want to get these. Because I have a D icon binder. It's kind of weird that these are not in there just because these are older. This Armpedia. I also wanted to do a reorganization of my BTS binders in particular because I did give away quite a bit of like sugar stuff to my friend, one of my best friends who is who's just starting out with her collection and is moving out of the Philippines. So I wanted to just, you know, give her a little kickstart by helping her out and getting some stuff for my collection, which I was perfectly happy to do because, you know, she's super important to me. Um, and because of that, there are quite a bit Quite like just gaps in my collection that I wanted to fix up. But yeah. Right. Mm, okay, maybe it's here actually. Armypedia um, can stay there. And then I have a little army merch divider. And that's where I'll be putting in the army bomb photo cards. Right. So then it's army pedia, army kit stuff. Um, little wishes, because you can only get this actually if you're official army, right? So I think that's army merch and then just like the photos and stuff and tiny tan bits yes and then we have festa which isn't so much but I do want to move this actually a little like I wanted to go before army merch. So I just have a little divider. Fully aware that the dividers are shorter <laughs> than my pages, but okay. I'm okay with that. These A4 pages are just big. Yeah. divider for that and these all of these I will actually move to my bulky binder yeah Ooh. even yeah all of these will go to my bulky binder some cards in front because they're so pretty um, yeah. and just like position that there because we will be adding pages here as well Mm 
Masters, and for Samsung. So I'm just adding two nine pockets here for a few bits to add. So for the first one, I have these lenticulars, Chilsung Cider lenticulars. And I actually, what was it? I had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yes. So I had these in top loaders, but I found that I was not, I literally never saw them because they were in like a separate section like a little box that I just never opened so it's just better if I put them in the binder like this this is an OT7 set now if you watched my gin binder setup video you will you would have seen that I do have a gin oh no I don't I do not have a gin did I did I have a gin yes yes I had a gin Lenti there. That's just a spare one that I have. And yeah, I was still able to maintain my OT7 set, which is nice. I will also add these MTPR lenticulars. This is not an OT7 said. I have four of these. One of them is gin, which is in the gin binder. So in this page, we will have RM, Jimin, and V. And I just have a row of glitter cards. Because I have some spares. Yeah, I have a lot of those just on cider lenties. So funny. Why is that funny? I don't know. But I think it's funny. Um, yeah. So we have RM Sugar and J Hope here. There. I think that's cute. We have some some section. Ooh, I am supposed to put some fillers here. Okay. I don't know, I'm just gonna use these white fillers for now. <laughs> I just put in like a little gin placeholder. You notice these? Other placeholders that are placed in there or fillers. Yeah, because I did get gin from these sets, which I think is okay. Um, let's add in a sleeve here. Binder. Yes, I think so. Next, as we have my tours and concerts binder. I'm actually doing just one thing here, which is four rings. I just wanted to add the Army Pedia photos. Should I put this in the, you know what, it's fine. Let's add this here, just the link part. That's literally it for this binder. The rest are okay. 
great. Yeah, that's it. That was simple. Great. And let's just, you know, appreciate the other half of that, the icon poster that I cut up to make binder covers. <laughs> I think it's better though, because again, I've literally never unrolled that. And it's such a shame because these are gorgeous photos. Next is my DVD content memory seasons greetings summer winter package binder. Um, yeah, so. changing that with this divider so you can see I have quite a fair bit of notes here add content divider done Ooh. okay so I'm actually adding a nine pocket page right in front of the spider and it's because we will be adding these PCs that I have, which is in the same box where I kept the lenticulars, which is sad. So I never got to see them. These are just like muster PCs. I actually pulled a J Hope, I believe, in my muster Blu ray. And I wanted to move these. Did I? Maybe I shouldn't actually. Hmm. I don't want to move these because. Okay, okay, let's not move that. So let's keep these in front. Um, that's from third muster, then we have fifth muster. RM and J Hope. And I think initially I wanted to get these and put them here, but. That would mean that the orientation would be wrong, and I don't want that. So instead, I do I do have like the D icon Japan edition double sided card, and I do have the in the soup um, season two group card. Maybe again, these are actually better off in this six pocket instead of that nine pocket. These fillers, and that's why this was the content section, not. And even if the icon's not really content, I don't think it fits in the D icon binder. There's no like small stuff there that it can fit in because it's. Yeah, I'm happy to put it here first. I don't want to mix it with the other D icon. Mm, or, you know what, yeah, we can do that, I think. Let's keep this. And still keep the filler here. Now I'll just have, like, a bunch of fillers here. It's just covered. It really just bothers me if I can see through to the other page, like the one behind it. So I don't mind if it's like this for now. It's okay. Because I don't want to change the orientation to these. It's perfect in landscape mode. Anyway. Um, that's the next bit. Oops. in here for memories of 2018 um yeah i'm just 
just gonna be moving these up. I don't want to get Jin from this Memories set just because it's a nice OT7 set so I don't want to ruin that. I'm just moving these so that the right corner becomes empty. And I put a little filler there instead. I just like keeping that right corner empty. Okay, and then boom. Okay, and I think because I had like gin here. I wanted to just reshuffle this, so that's why there's an empty spot. I wanted to just reshuffle this so that um, mm, you know, let's move these up. These are from the concept books, the Mots One concept books. means the divider is wrong because this is memories and these are not just memories or was I okay with that actually these are all memories except for these four I'm okay with that that's fine and the concept box stuff divider for seasons greetings nope Summer and winter packages. Yes. Um, this one I did get Jin's um, double sided photo. So I'm just going to put a little winter package filler here. This is actually an envelope or a little paper, sorry, from the actual winter package. So it just fills up the page. Okay, that's a gorgeous mini poster, by the way. Then just, this is where we'll have the season's greetings divider. And what I actually did with these is I got all of the ID photos and put them one after the other, which I think is super nice. They have extra ID photos for JK and J Hope. Um to do ah, okay so I'll just put these like behind themselves you know maybe I can change those out into clear sleeves the reason why they're in the colored sleeves is they have a bit more grip for the IDs I can just change those into clear sleeves okay 2021 and I really like this like when I put all the ID pages one after the other then we go into like the bigger inclusions. Yes. Ooh, there is a bit here that I wanted to do, which is to get these. So these are all the docu series, movies, and the soup stuff. I just wanted to move them in front. To the content section. So let me do that. Yes. Yes. 
on this so I did forget something in the tourist binder. I was like, that was it? Surely I was forgetting something. And I did forget something. So let's add that in. Go back in the tourist binder. And I needed to add these permission to dance on stage mini PCs. I don't have a lot, but but I do have like four. Three units and like a sugar one. <laughs> so random. Yeah. So the way I'll do this is mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, let's keep let's let's keep the bottom row empty. And then let's have sugar just be here in the kind of middle. Then I just have these fillers, just like gunmetal, metallic, or reflective cardstock. Yeah, that's it. I don't know if I'll be getting more of these photo cards, but. I have these four. Yeah. Okay, I don't know why my phone was stopped recording, but we're still in the album section, still in the Korean section. I have just placed, I've just pulled all of the non mini PCs out because um, we'll be putting that in another binder. And I, we're in B right now because I do have a B and a D icon binder for some reason. I felt the need to put them together. I don't know, at the time it felt right. But now what I want to do is just get those mini PCs that I do have for B and put them here. Um, because ah, I know why. It's because I didn't have space in this album anymore. Um, but we created space because we removed those non-mini PC bits. So let's just put these B mini PCs in here, both from the um, Deluxe and Essential Edition. And you know, some like lucky draw bits here and there. Yeah, B had a lot of photo cards. Right. Butter, and here we also have some non mini PC inclusions. We'll just get, get this together. And then we got a little Japanese divider. That's it. I did not get gin from my Japanese photo cards because I was really just collecting gin and V because it was more disruptive to get him and then like reorganize all of these. Like I could have put all of them on like just one page, but like I spent so much effort in these fillers that I don't want to waste them. So like they're not just printed, like I handmade these like with stickers and stuff. So yeah, let's just keep it like that. It's fine. Ooh. These are photo cards, yes. 
but because they're so big, I won't move them in another binder. I'll keep them here because they're like the photo cards for those albums. But I will move them at the back. Right? Yeah. So these I will take out. I do think these are like non-mini PCs. So yeah, but these I'll just put at the back. Just so again they, it just you know sits better there. can do this yes right let's see let's see actually if there's a bit more breathing room now that we've removed those like big album inclusions from this binder no yes i can see it i can see it there's like there's so much space now yeah i'm ready i'm ready to take in photo cards for the next BTS comeback. <laughs> okay. That's it for this binder. Now, I have a new binder here. This is actually a Staples Better binder. Yeah, it's not purple, but just so you can see, I used the same like spine labeling um, stuff. And I'm just going to put this, which I got from the D-Icon again, <clears throat> excuse me, from the D-Icon calendar. And you know, it's such a nice photo, so I just cut that out. It's been over a year and I haven't looked at them, so I'm pretty confident in cutting up the D-Icon stuff. Again, just to close it out, this is where we'll be putting like, the big part from this stuff from my album binder. I will actually be putting like the B album stuff here because they are bigger album inclusions. And again, I couldn't put them in the album binder because she had no space. But since we have this binder now for not many PC album inclusions. Might yeah, as well put all the big album bits together, right? I just realized I made a little mistake because, of course, butter has to go after this. What's that? What's that? Oh, okay. There's an Ultra Pro page right in the middle. There we go. There. Right. Okay. And here we're not really going to separate the Korean and album stuff anymore because we're not that many of the Japanese stuff that warrants a separate section for it. So let's just put these together. Absolutely love this little standy page that I made for You Never Walk Alone. Yeah, that's it for the non mini PC album inclusions binder, which has like one of the cutest cover photos. Nope, that's not it. Actually, it. I. Need to go to the B part because 
I actually have the B photo card binder. Totally forgot that there's this awesome photo there. Until I was cleaning out my stuff. So we might as well add it here. It is B. So yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah, that's it. Or it's a non-mini PC album inclusions binder. Okay, I think this is the last. I think this is the last binder that we'll have to do for BTS. Oh my god, I'm gonna get my icon keychain for Jin. Let me put that in the Jin binder actually. See, I have this, like the Japan one. Where should I put it? Maybe, 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 maybe. Yes. Let's put it here. Like instead of having just a plain filler, let's just put it here. And then, let's see. I also wanted to put these pages, like the, they're still the icon, but they're not the older. I think these are 2018. This binder used to house B and the icon 2020, 2021. But now this is gonna house the icon, including like the 2018 version. Plus the fact I totally forgot about these postcards, so I did add like the Jin postcards in the Jin binder. But like this is the reason why I got the fact photo book was for these. Um, postcards. So what I did, these are actually envelopes that house like the four sets of postcards. I just cut up the front covers to make this little cover. So it's just a little two pocket that has them now. Yeah, so the fact photo book. Totes forgot about you. Sorry. And then I also had these like mini posters that are actually nicely sized. Um, so I'm adding these in as well, like, look at these. I didn't have to cut them up just a little bit, like, trim them just a little bit so they'll fit in these one pockets. But these are super gorge. That's such a shame not to be putting them in the binder so I can see them better, you know? What's that? Okay, it's just a little filler. And these are the fact photo book. Um, postcards. So I've just, you know, filled them in already in the pockets. Oops. Look, such pretty photos. And again, you won't see Jin here because his postcards are in his binder. Look at him being such a bias and having his own binder. Wow. And 
actually what I wanted to add here was the cover and I got this the little lenticular cover for the D-Icon calendar yeah again I cut that up now it's here so let's just put her in I might have to cut this will it fit actually if it's like this so it will No, it won't. I have to cut that out a little bit more. But honestly, I'm just gonna drop it in like this. That's gorge. Now you know it's like the D icon binder and the fact. Uh, actually, sorry. There is one more binder, which is the bulky binder, and this cover page I also got from the D icon photo book and cut that up. Just removing. Okay, I'm gonna remove these and cut these. These are like muster tour stuff. I'm gonna put that in the album big inclusions binder because there's like literally no more space for these brand collab bulky bits that I wanted to put here. So let's do that. Like so many two bucket pages. Like, look, if I can still, maybe, 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 I can do instead. We can keep a few of them here. Yes. These are actually, particularly the plastic folders can go in the album Big Inclusions Binder. Let's go back to that. Right, oh, she moved, she moved so much. Okay, I'm just gonna have to tape that later. Um, I don't know what I do. Ah, yeah. So, the map for the soul. Let's just add in, in these plastic folders. And don't hate me. These are the muster poster books, poster book pages that are not just big but thick. So let's just put it at the back. And I still want to protect them anyway, and they were going to be destroyed if they would live. I'll just add a little divider here. That's the end of like the BTS binder reorganization. That was a bit chaotic, despite my best effort to pre-plan and put those like post-its and tags, whatever. Uh, it's okay. You never know <laughs> what happens in life. Wow. Um, but yeah, that's part two of my little like photo card collection reorganization series. <laughs> it's become a series now. Um, 
yeah so if you want to check out my gin binder video and you haven't seen that i will link that you can feel free to watch that that's a long one and i will be i'm pretty sure the next video or like my non-bts binder um, reorganization will be very very long um that will be the final bit to this reorganization series anyway i hope you guys enjoy that i now have more than six binders for bts i think i have seven now or eight um but that's okay because i think it's just about giving space in the binder so that they can breathe better and you know continue to protect the photo cards and stuff that's it um thanks so much for watching hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you guys next time bye